Meet Katie and Anisha. They're both about to go to an interview and as you can see they already look very different to each other. Dressing smart is very important for first impressions. You should wear something professional and appropriate for the interview. Uh oh, someone forgot to do their research. We'll catch up with Katie later. Let's just see how Anisha gets on. As you saw, it's important to do your research before the interview. Check the location, what the organisation does and what questions they might ask you. This will show commitment and eagerness to get the job. Let's see where Katie is. As we said, it's important to do your research, especially to know where you are going. You also want to be around 10 minutes early for your interview, unlike Katie, who was 10 minutes late. Wow, I can't believe what I just saw. Let's see that again. I'll leave it to you guys to decide which is a better greeting. Remember, in an interview, you should sit with good posture and make sure your full attention is on the interviewer. Fiddling shows that you're uninterested and unprofessional. Don't forget to turn off your phone. It is important to keep eye contact with the interviewer and not to fidget or overuse hand gestures. It will show that you are focused. If you're constantly looking around the room, the interviewer may think you're distracted. Sitting up straight and smiling will make the interviewer think of you as positive and interested. Answer the questions clearly. Try not to use ums and uhs. Take your time. When you are asked if you have any questions, try to at least ask two. Usually about the role or the organisation, but never ask... Yeah, how much money do I get paid? Don't forget, when leaving an interview, be polite and shake the interviewer's hand. Most importantly, stay professional until you are completely clear. Making a good impression on the interviewer is very important because it may determine if you'll be employed. Make sure you do the things Anisha does and don't follow the actions of Katie. Sometimes we may be doing it without even noticing it. So practice with friends and family. Always prepare for the interview and you'll do great.